human. Play, Tom Jot, human. Hello once again my lovelies. Pirate Scum Gaming here. Tonight I want to talk to you about Task Force Operations. I know they may seem daunting for newer players and sometimes daunting for even more experienced players. So I'm going to try to take the venom out of them. And tonight I'm going to be talking about a very easy one to either pug or do in a team environment gateway to Grethor. This one came out during the Iconian at work and is very simple and easy to complete. You have three main stages. First stage, clearing out the starbase and the shipyard. Second stage, make sure and protect all of the troop transports, closing the radiation gateways and making sure they land their troops. And third stage, taking out the Iconian dreadnought that comes in and then doing any other ancillary mop up. Like I said, this is very easy. It's an easy one to do. Doesn't take doesn't take that much time at all. I like to do this one. It is one of my favorites. And in this video, I am going to do a walkthrough on how to run it. And for this video, I have a pre-assembled team that I chose of my good friends. So, without further ado, let me get my team assembled, and I'll catch you on the flip side. Okay, everybody, my team is assembled. As you can see, everybody is indicated that they are ready to go. So we are going to jump right in here. So basically, uh, if you're going to be pugging this, you'll be going out of the Task Force Operation tab, which is up here. Here is the gateway to Grethor. Those are your difficulty levels. I always try to do this on advanced if I'm plugging this. I highly recommend this. Especially if you're not, uh, don't think you're quite ready for elite content because elite IS GGA, sorry, GGA gets a little hairy. So best bet is if you're going to plug this to do this on advanced. But since I have a pre-made team, what I'm going to do is in the private tab. All right, my team is ready. They are standing by. Let's go ahead and get this going. All right, here's Gateway to Grethor. I am choosing the advanced level. And then all I got to do is start Private Task Force Operation, and you're off to the races. So let's go kill us some Iconians. Sometimes the server is a little pokey. Ah, that coin is just scared. They don't want to come out of hiding. There we go. All right, there's two options here. You can either go left or you can go right. Myself, I prefer to go left and some people prefer to go right. The thing to remember is there's going to be a group in the middle. Ignore them. They are, don't bother with them. All they are is just trouble. Your main objective is to clear the star base and the shipyard on the left and the right. Anything else just in the way. Here we go. I'm going left. Alright, 
this side is done, the other side is done. Now comes the second phase. Okay, so basically in this phase, your job is to guard the troop transports. You're gonna, a couple of things are gonna happen. You're gonna see some yellow portals and some green portals. Your job is to close the green portals. Leave the yellow ones alone. See that, see that uh, green one over there? That's what we're going for. Those green, those green portals will kill the transports as they're proceeding to do right. Best bet is to come to a stop while you're trying to close them. So basically, while you're waiting for those portals to pop, the green portals to pop up again, uh, open season. Come some more troop transports. Your job, your sole job here is to protect those troop transports, make sure they deliver their cargo. The objective you have to meet is you have to have at least transport ten transports landed. And the objective is meet. Oh, there is a there's a portal. Let's go get There we go. Let's get those troops to the planet and kicking them Iconians' asses. Green portals, that means we gotta close it. It's gonna kill the transports. As it's trying to kill me. Good luck with that. Like I said earlier, ignore these yellow ones. They're harmless. If he kills one of them, two more are going to spawn. Your main job, like I said, kill the kill, get the green ones, get the radiation ones. Between, and in between closing the radiation ones, just kill the enemy. Send those Iconians to the scrapyard. We are in real good shape here. We are in real good shape. And the more bonus transports that land, the more marks you get.
This this stage is almost done. You got about a minute left. Then comes the final stage where you blow the dreadnought to Kingdom Come. Make sure you get those radiation gateways as soon as they pop up. We're going to get this one final radiation gateway and then we're going to start heading over to the uh, sweet spot to, to make preparations for the third for the third phase. All right, at about 21 20 seconds, start moving. All right, here we go. It, it's coming up. This is the fun part. My friends and I like to take bets on uh, just how fast we can uh, kill this dreadnought. The fast we've been able to take it down is three seconds flat. Here we go. Sayonara Dreadnought. Now what we all do is do a little bit of cleanup operations. That, ladies and gentlemen, is that. You know, we here at Papa Sierra Bravo and Pirate Scum Brotherhood, you know, we have a saying whenever we go into battle. We don't call for backup. We call for cleanup. And that is pretty much the long and short of Gateway to Grethor. Very easy TFO to run. Very puggable. Three stages. First stage. Clear up the star base and the shipyard. Second stage. Protect the transports. Make sure you're closing those radiation gateways because they'll kill the transports. And that makes things very difficult. And then third phase. Knock out the dreadnought and mop up what's left. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. This can be pugged like I said. I hope this video has helped you guys out seeing how to do this. There will be more of these coming up, so stay tuned. And like I always say, don't go by the book, think like a pirate. And I'll see you next time. Like all Starfleet, you talk and you talk, but you have no grumba. Oh.